Hello everyone. Today in this video we are discussing how to create queues in Salesforce. The queues are used to allocate the records that do not have any users as a owner. The users who have approached to the queue are called the queue members. The members in the queue can inspect the records in the queue and hold the owners and the ones they need. When the new record is attached to the queue, the email is sent to the queue member. The Salesforce queue email template can set the email for the queue members. Until the queue member can pick the records, the records still remain in the queue. The queue are only supported for the leads and the sales. There are the two versions in which we have created our queues. The first version is Salesforce Lightning version in which we created our queues. So let me show you. So here you can see I open my Salesforce Lightning version and in this we have to create our queues. So for this I firstly move to my gear icon. This is my gear icon and you can see that under this gear icon there are two options. First one is setup and the another one is service setup. Click on the setup option. After clicking on the setup option, you can see that the setup page is open. Now enter the queues in the quick find box. Click on the queue option. After clicking on the queue option, the queue page is open. In this queue page, there are a new option button. Click on this button. After clicking on the new button, the new queue page is open. Here, we fill the information inside the page. Firstly, fill the label. Here, we are filling label as United State Lead Queue. And the queue name is automatically filled. If we want to send the email to all the queue members, select this checkbox. Send email to the members. Now, scroll to the bottom and select the spotted object. Now, first click on the available object and then add this highlighted object to the selected object. First, we selected the lead object and the next object we want to select as a USA student and add to the selected object. Now, again scroll to the bottom of the page and Add the members to this queue. We can select the type of the members to the available members section. We are selected the user and add this user to the selected member. And then click on save option. After clicking on the save option, you can see that our queue is successfully created. Now we will move ahead and learn how to create queues in Salesforce Classic. So let me show you. So here is our Salesforce Lightning version. By default, when we open the Salesforce, it will automatically open the Lightning Edition. So we have to switch it to the Classic version for working with the Classic Edition. So we have to click on our profile picture. This is our profile picture. And here you can see we have an option switch to Salesforce Classic. Click on it and you can see that our Salesforce Classic version is open. So now here we will create our queues. After logging to the Salesforce Classic, click on the setup. After clicking on the setup, click on the drop down arrow of the manage users. And you can see that the manage users list is open. Select the queue inside this list that is present under the manage users. After clicking on the queues option, the queues page is open. In this queues page, the new button is present. Click on the new button. After clicking on the new button, the new queue page is open. Fill the information inside the page. Firstly, fill the label. Here we are filling the label as Chicago Lead Queues. After filling the label, the queue name is automatically filled. If we want the email to send all the queue members, 
then select the checkbox of the send email to members now scroll to the bottom of the page now select the supported objects firstly click on the available objects here we want to add the lead from the available objects to the selected objects and then we want to add the expense from the available objects to the selected objects now scroll to the bottom of the page and select the queue members here we are selecting the users and add this users from the available members to the selected members and then click on the save option and you can see that the chicago lead queues is created successfully and present below the new button so with this we have learned how to create queues in salesforce so if this video was helpful click on the like button and also subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos like this one thanking you for watching have a great day